All right, what's up, YouTube? So doing something a little different today. I've been looking on uh, Google Maps here, and there's this huge, you know, wildlife area. You see all this here with the nature center, and there's this huge bayou, Armand Bayou, that goes all the way in here. And the, there's all these dirt trails and stuff like that that go through here, but this is all fenced off as far as I can tell. Uh, this is a fire station. But right in here, there's a way to get in, uh, but it's still blocked off by this uh, little ravine here. But you can ride around this way, and then there's this like, old bridge right here. And it gives you access to this side here. Th this pit's part's open, you can go explore over here and stuff, but what I really want to do is find a way to get into this area here. This is fenced, but I'm hoping maybe I can get in over here somewhere. Because if I can get back here, I get access to these trails, right? And they can go deeper into the area here. I just want to go in and explore around here. I think these are high voltage lines here. You know, yeah, they are. So I'm not sure, you know, if I get in trouble or not. I mean, from the look of these trails, like if you look at this one, it looks like there's a lot of uh, four wheeling happen happening over here. People come exploring and stuff like that. So, you know, I think people do get in here somehow. And mess around like look at these these tracks look at people are doing donuts over here and whatnot you can tell so yeah so today I'm gonna go right over there just kind of check it out um, get over here see how far in I can get check out this bridge looks interesting just explore around the area a little bit all right guys well hey I'll see you in a minute when I'm on my phone. So getting uh, Tesla Solar put on today. I'll be doing another video of that. But right now I want to go explore the area that I talked about earlier. Alright, well, I'll see you guys uh, when I get closer over there. Yeah, I'm still on my way, but I found this interesting little spot I want to check out near this park right here. See there's like this bridge over there? Just want to see what that is. Some information about the local birds here and butterflies and stuff oh look at that that's interesting oh dang it's a swamp wow that is cool dude there's got to be alligators in here wow what a cool little spot look at that cool little bird over there it's gonna get eaten by a gator. Yeah, when you think alligators, this is exactly what you think about. Cool. Well, that's pretty sweet. All right, I'm gonna continue on. I'll see you guys when I get over there. All right, guys. Well, here's the entrance I was talking about. Let's get up here. So I should be able to follow this thing all the way around to this bridge. It doesn't really look like this area gets much traction as far as like walking or anything. Nice little creek right here. Yeah, see that whole area is fenced off. Actually kind of sucks. Hey. No. No. No.
Oh, that sucks. Well, that blows that video idea. Fucking dogs. When people leave their goddamn gate open like that, it's so annoying. Yeah, I don't want to risk him like biting my leg or something. I'm gonna go fuck around over here though and see what's, what's going on over here. Yeah, see, there's this fire station here, but like this whole thing's like fenced off. Oh, we can just go around this way. I don't think that dog would have crossed the ravine. Yeah, that's really irresponsible for them to just leave their gate open like that. Because what people walk back here, you know, maybe they ride bikes or something, you know. The dog seemed a little aggressive. If he wasn't as scared of me as he was, he might have come up and bit me. And if I had reacted different with dogs like that, you don't show any fear when they come at you. Because if they sense fear, they sense that energy, they're going to come after you. So the best thing to do is just to remain calm, assertive, like Caesar Milan says. Don't show any fear. Yeah, she put the she closed the gate. All right, video continues. Yeah, so I'm gonna be adding some different videos on, mostly still this, but I'm gonna do like a a review of my uh, Tesla that I bought used. So you know what it's like to buy a used Tesla and so on, and then of my uh, the solar panel system that's getting installed now, which is also Tesla with the power walls and whatnot. So there's that bridge up there that I was, that I was talking about. And there's like a, a pond back over here. I mean, it's not too sketch. I mean, I wonder if you can get out that way. Ooh, this is kind of creepy over here. It's got a Blair Witch kind of feel to it. Man, I wish this area wasn't fenced off over here. I wonder if it's like federal land or something or, or what. People get in there somehow, I know that, because of all those tracks. Those 4 by tracks and the donut tracks and stuff. Let's see if I can spot any alligators here. I mean, I haven't seen any no trespassing signs or anything like that for this, this area, at least. And by the looks of all the trash in that pond there, people come out here and hang out. Yeah, there's a lot of areas like this around me. What is this? Some, somebody was burning some, some wood over here. That's strange. So it's pretty much dead ends right here. Looks like they had a little fire going. Drinking some beers and sitting by a little fire there. But all the cool shit's in there. Still, so interesting spot. Let me know what you guys think about these uh, little exploration videos, these vlogs. I'm not talking a whole lot, but just kind of more exploring areas by my house, trying to find little pieces of nature in the city kind of thing always use some feedback if you like these i'll just keep them going the way they are try to mix it up too i'm gonna be uh, maybe tomorrow i'm gonna go out to um this boardwalk place it has a bunch of rides and shit i'll do more of like a vlog and uh i worked with refugees for a long time for years and so i maybe just tell you some some interesting stories that i heard about that um i'll do that tomorrow probably and then post it in a few days here i wonder what's over here I mean, still haven't seen any no trespassing signs or anything. Seems like this kind of area is open to the to the public. It's just an empty field. I don't think I can get out over there to the street. So let's just go back the way I came. You know, so far I've said this in the last video, but I, I'm really loving these wheels. The stock wheels are the way to go. Just keep the stock wheels and 219 inch. I got mine powder coated to make it look a little nicer. But get these Shanko 241s put on, and you're good to go. Street riding, off road riding. I mean, you can do anything. And like, I don't have any experience riding off-road and I feel comfortable on them. They have good enough traction for me. Yeah, fuck it, that dog would be like a good uh, thumbnail though. I'll put that dog as a thumbnail. How many people just leave their gate open like that? That's pretty bird. I want to see what that sign says back there. Because it has like a warning on it. I'm just curious to see what it says. It says, warning, natural gas pipeline. Okay, it's just saying don't dig right there. That's a pipeline. So this is just like a, oh, so there's not even any um, high voltage wires, which I thought it's actually, this is, I guess, there's a pipeline right here. So that's why they have it dug up or blocked off. I mean, it's a big old bird over there. I think that's a vulture. I mean, it makes sense, you know, 
you don't want people screwing around where there's a natural gas pipeline but I wish they would make you know some of the other area available for people to come and explore yeah I'm gonna get in here somehow someday I just have to get back on uh, Google Maps and see if I can find another entrance somewhere else I wonder what's back over there I mean there's gates but I haven't seen any like no trespassing signs or anything like that that kind of say why all those spots off limits I mean it could be private property I'm not sure well, I know the nature reserve over there is obviously not private property. Well, I'm going to go maybe see if I can explore, get another access point. Actually, I'm going to stop and look at my Google Maps and see where else I can go. Alright, I found another spot where I might be able to get in and do some exploring. I'm going to head over there. Alright, I'll see you guys when I get to that entrance there. Alright, this is some kind of walking trail here, but it seems to go around. Maybe I can find a way to get in because it borders that same forest area just a little bit further down. This also looks like a gatory type of place. Yeah, let's pay attention to see if we can find any trails actually going into this wooded area. I mean, it's pretty dense forest in there. Oh, this is something. Oh, well, this kind of goes right up to the edge of the bayou here, but, oh, look at that. There's a trail right there, but I just want to check this out really quick. Cool. Beautiful over here. Look at that. Which way should I go, guys? Ooh, let's go this way. Looks a little spoopy in here. There are snakes around and stuff. Oh, wouldn't that be creepy if I just came up on a fucking alligator? Chilling in the fucking... That just goes down to the water right there, actually. Let's go back. It's a good opportunity to uh, test out my um, reverse. I've never used reverse before on this. So... Reverse. What? That is very convenient. A little torquey. All right, was able to maneuver out of that. Let's see where this other trail goes. You know, I should really put on some pants when I do this shit, huh? I don't like pants, though. This is more like it. Oh, nice. Look at that. This is the kind of thing I wanted to find right here. Just a few miles from my house, too. Easy ride. Let's see. Looks like the trail keeps going. A good fishing spot right here, too. So you can't go that way. That looks a little... Yeah, I'm not gonna go down there. What do you guys think? It's pretty sweet, huh? When you think Houston, you don't think of this, right? Let's see what else we can find. If you still haven't bought a Saran and you're watching my videos, and you're wondering if they're worth it. I mean, because anything I'm doing here, you can do stock. You don't have to fucking spend, you know, 10 grand tricking out your fucking surround like I did. Or probably more like 11 or 12 now. But that's how I am with shit. Like, you see my gaming PC, I just go overboard. Little turtle chilling on that thing right there. Another turtle in there with his head sticking out of the water. All right, looks like this just leads back into, let's see, where are we going here? We can follow this, see where it goes. These butterflies are starting to come back again. I think during spring, there's just a, there's just like a shitload of those in, in Houston. 
Well, this has been a good little trip. Found some cool stuff. Yeah, I think what I'll do is I'll take a, a like a screenshot of that bayou back there, that really pretty area, and kind of split screen it with that dog and say something like, the title will be like Beauty and the Beast or something like that. Well, let's go back and see how much progress they made on the solar so far. It's really cool how, how Google has like the, the bike sort of directions. So it takes you on these bike trails instead of like the streets when they're available. Look, that guy has no control over his dog. Yeah, dogs are kind of a liability with these bikes, I guess. They don't like them. I got chased by a little puppy the other day, but then I had that encounter with that dog earlier. One of these days, I'm gonna get fucked up by a dog. Well, this is a cool little bridge coming up. I have to cross it to get to the other side. Yeah, it's such a cool area. There's all these uh, bayous and trails around them all over the area. There's one right by my house. I mean, there's just, there's just tons of them. Cool little walking bridge right here to cross over. Bunch of turtles hanging out right there. You see them? <gasps> Look at that. Look at that. All those little baby ducks. Oh my god. Can you guys see that? Alright. I, I gotta get some better footage of that. This time I'll remember to press record. So you have to wait for this red dot to pop up. No, I'm recording. Kind of get a better view of the area with this thing. But isn't that cute? Jeez. Alright, I'm home now. Well, uh, hey, thanks for watching, guys. That'll be it for this one. 